of the all-new BMW M2 uh, to the market. I mean, isn't she stunning? Uh, so the vehicle that you see in front of you is the positioning color called uh, Zanford Blue. Uh, I'll just take a few minutes to actually condition you to some of the key features and product highlights of the all-new BMW M2. Starting at the front of the vehicle, you'll see the unframed uh, kidney grills uh, with the horizontal side struts. Um, also complemented by the large intakes, which is responsible for cooling down the 3-liter twin-turbo motor, which generates 338 kilowatts at 550 newton meters of torque. Mm. An impressive not to 100 is in 4.1 seconds, uh, which uh, it's achieved at 250 kilometers per hour, um, which can also then be increased to 285 kilometers per hour with the optional M drivers package. If you make your way to the side of the vehicle, you'll see the prominent flared wheel arches with the widened side skirts, and for the first time ever, the M carbon roof is available for the all new uh, BMW M2. Making our way to the rear of the vehicle, you'll see the iconic uh, M twin tailpipes, which is uh, notorious uh, within the portfolio. And then lastly, moving into the interior, for all those manual transmission fanatics, the M2 will be available in manual transmission, uh, but standard will be the automatic uh, transmission. Something also I need to bring your attention to is the M-Carbon uh, bucket seats, which is exclusive to the M-Racetrack package. 
Uh, so just to sum it up, um, I mean the car speaks for itself. Um, this really is designed uh, for real petrol heads that's looking for uncompromised power and sheer driving pleasure. So I ask you to please remain seated. Um, in typical M fashion, we have a lot more product to showcase before you guys can actually make your way to the vehicles and take pictures. So enjoy the rest of your evening and hope you guys have a blast outside. Thank you.
Welcome on stage, Ryan Vanasuria. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hello. Ryan. Hello. Ryan. How are you guys doing? Yeah, we're live. Is it evening or afternoon still? I'm not sure. Uh, but as you can see, we don't stop at BMW M though. We've got two of the gifts from this celebration, celebration here, and two of the best gifts of them all. Now, I can't do it on my own. I've got my colleague Nati here, and he's going to talk about XM a little bit later, and how this vehicle is going to break new ground. But before we get to that, let's talk about the crown jewel in the BMW M portfolio. This is the pinnacle of M high performance. It is the M4 CSL competition sport lightweight. This is the fastest ever BMW production car, and I will qualify that answer a little bit later when I get into some of the technical numbers. It's also the most powerful production M4 of all time. This car is born from the racetrack, and only a few will be lucky enough to own such an icon. And this car will be a future classic in years to come. The CSL badge has donned the greatest cars in the BMW lineup. In 50 years, only three cars have ever had the CSL badge donned their car. That's the original 3 liter CSL 1973, that we moved 30 years later to more recent times, where we as South Africans know the E46 M3 CSL, right? But yeah, yeah, bo. A car, a car revered, still to this day, especially judging by resale value in that car, right? So, this is the third. That list is short and sweet, and that's it. The greatest hits is three cars and that's it. Now that we have some context of how important the car is within the BMW world, let's look at what makes this car so special from technical highlights to some exterior and interior features, right? So starting on the front of the car, it was unmistakable when it came in, right? You knew this was the M4 c because no other BMW looks like this. So it has a high gloss black kit negro with red accents, the carbon fiber splitter, but most importantly, the key feature being the laser lights with yellow icons. So, <laughs> you'll get another chance later, don't worry, you'll get another chance later. So moving from there, another first, something you don't see in any in vehicles really, exposed carbon fiber, right? And you see the red accents, how they flow from the front of the car, over the carbon roof to the rear, where you find my favorite feature on the car, and that's an integrated ducktail. So that's also first for the M M4 CSL. No other M car has that. You'll find also emphasizing the sporty appeal, the twin pipes, but made out of titanium and matte black tail pipes. Looking at the side of the car, pretty sexy the profile, I have to say. The fronts are 19 inch wheels, the back are twenties. But what's so important about this is M doesn't leave any stone unturned. These wheels are specifically made for this vehicle. And not only that, the ultra race track tires are fitted specifically for just this vehicle. The colors, this car is Alpine white. We did offer this car in black sapphire. And on your screen, my personal favorite, the frozen Brooklyn gray, which is also an exclusive for M4 CSL. So motorsport heritage doesn't just stop on the outside. Let's go to the inside of the car, right? And you're gonna find full racing carbon fiber bucket seats with the CSL illuminated badging. At the back, you'll find a compartment with two helmets because if you want to get the best out of this car, you're not going to be on the road. You have to take it to a track. And most importantly, the driver is going to be holding onto an M Alcantara steering wheel with carbon fiber shifters. So this car was designed to provide maximum driving performance, and the engineers achieved this by doing the following: number one, the weight was reduced by 100 kilograms compared to an M4 competition rear wheel drive. And how did they do that? Through the carbon fiber components we just spoke about, the wheels, the carbon fiber seats, etc. Number two, they've tuned up this engine to provide 30 more kilowatts. So a standard input competition has 375 kilowatts, this is 405 kilowatts. And the numbers just keep on rolling from there. 650 newton meters of torque, zero to 103.7 seconds, and it tops out at 307 kilometers an hour. Underneath the bonnet, Hidden is the, is the jewel of the M4 CSL, why it has such great driving characteristics. And that's because it's an imprecision strut. It's made from a light alloy material. And what it just does, it stiffens up the front end of the car and gives it its precise handling. All of this means that this vehicle is the fastest ever BMW production car around the famed Nordschleifer circuit. And for those who are car fanatics and race fanatics, you know that the Nordschleifer circuit is the benchmark and the yardstick for which all supercars and hypercars are measured against. And out of all the great BMWs ever produced, this was the fastest ever around it. In summary, 
This car provides the most thrill. It was supposed to provide, it was supposed to provide the maximum driving dynamics and the most emotional experience. Ladies and gentlemen, this car is the unicorn of the BMW M Liner. Majestic, powerful, and rare. For most of us sitting here today, it'll be the last time we ever see this car. So, you guys will get to take it in a little bit later and enjoy it. But before we do that, I'm going to hand over to Nati, and he's going to take you through XM. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ryan. Thank you very much. What a fantastic car that you're having here for us today. But, ladies and gentlemen, the Festival of Motoring from BMWM as we celebrate the 50 years doesn't end there, it continues to the car that is breaking new grounds. This is basically the new concept that BMW came up with on the celebration of the 50th anniversary. This is going to be the first BMW high performance vehicle that has electric drive system, which is amazing. And lastly, on this car, this is the first BMW M original vehicle, or should I say, standalone vehicle, since we last produced the BMW M1, which most of you maybe had a time to interact with it, since it's also on display here. So, this is indeed the car that's going to be breaking new grounds, complete new concept, and a new member of the BMW M family. So, without wasting too much time, I'll take you guys through some few of the highlights to introduce you to this new XM and then you will have time to interact with all these beautiful cars. So starting from the front, when you look at the new BMW XM, what you're going to see is the new BMW Luxury Class Identity. And this is one feature on the front end that we have only given to our top end models. How do you see it? You see it with the split headlights where we have our daytime driving light on top and all your functional lights being housed below there. And what you also notice with our high-end models, you see we have now what we call illuminated kidney grill, as you can see on this car. But because this car is again a special car, we have the outer border of our grill, which is covered with gold framing. And again, because this car is from the M brand of BMW. You will notice the hallmark feature of our BMW M vehicles, the horizontal bars with a beijing on the front. The BMW XM is definitely unparalleled in terms of presence and confidence when you look at it from the front. But let me take your attention now to the side profile of this vehicle. And when you look at the XM from the side, the first thing that you want to take your attention is the gold surrounds that goes around the windows all the way to the body. And this is the part that has been installed in the car to again pay homage to the BMW M1, which reminisces the black stripe that is on the M1 on the side. But you'll also notice the roof line of the vehicle. We call it the silhouette is dynamically sloping towards the back. And this gives this car basically a coupe-like character and you look at the car you see with that coupe-like character gives it more dynamic posture when you look at it from the side the car on display here today is in cape york green which is amongst one of the new colors that we just introduced but we have quite a few of visually stunning colors that will be available for this car to make sure that it gives that presence and also it still shows the dynamism in it. Again from, again, from the side, when you look at it, there's one feature that is first time we're having on the M models. We, for the first time, having 23-inch wheels on the BMW M model, and that's going to start from this car. So, getting to the rear of the vehicle, one thing that's gonna take your attention as soon as you see the rear of the car is a four-pipe exhaust pipes and those are, done, are vertically arranged two on each side but between those tail pipes the theme of the gold element continues with the rear diffuser which also has a nice gold trims in it and as you look on the rear again since this cap 
also has some reminiscence of the BMW M1. You will notice the two M logos that have been lasered into the rear windscreen. Again, that paying or giving a nod to the BMW M1. So when you look at this car from the rear, as you can see in the picture, it exudes that masculinity and powerful look from the back. It's a very powerful and muscular vehicle. But let's get to the interior now of this vehicle because this is a new concept. So even the interior, you'll find something that are very new for this car and new from the BMW brand as well. So when you open this car, standard feature, you will be greeted by the BMW driver focus cockpit. And all the displays, they're showing you that uh, M graphics that you need because the car is, again, from the M brand. But what you'll also notice for the first time, we have vintage leather on our vehicle. So when you look at the upper dashboard, we install the vintage leather and also on the door side uppers. When you look at the car from the interior also, on top of your roof headliner, we have installed what we call a 3D sculptural headliner. And this is a headliner that is designed to give you a 3D look, but also it is illuminated by different colors that you can get from your ambient interior lighting. So it gives the car a very nice feeling, which links it to the back of the vehicle, where we transformed the rear sitting bench to be an XM lounge. And that gives you maximum comfort and spacing, and you really have that lounge feel when you're sitting on the back. All in all, the interior of this car takes luxuriousness and modernity to another level. But ladies and gentlemen, before I finish, I think there's the most important part that I haven't mentioned yet. I just introduced it with the electric drive system. But what exactly propels this vehicle? We have in here a newly developed M drive hybrid system. What do I mean? We having a hybrid car which comprises of a V8 engine and the electric motor. And both combined, they deliver an exceptional power. The power output of this vehicle, we talk about system output of 480 kilowatt. And we have 800 newton meters of torque. So that combined, this gentleman gives you a sprint from 0 to 100 in about 4.3 seconds, which is quite massive for the car as big as this one. But that's the power that you get in this car. And also there's been some chases um, tuning to make sure that the car goes and gives you a widest spectrum from driving very dynamic to also get the comfort out of it. So I call this car a rock star. And it's because simply it's bold, it's unique, it's expressive, it's extroverted, and most importantly, it's electrified. So, welcome the new BMW XM. And in closing, I hope, ladies and gentlemen, you enjoyed the show of our presence that we have offered you today, the reveal of the M2, the M4 CSL, and the XM. So, without wasting much of your time, I would invite you to stay to have a look at the cars, but with one small condition on the M4 CSL, as my colleague mentioned, is one of the rare cars that we have in here, and it is very limited. So we will ask you to have a look at the car, take a pictures, open it, but you're not allowed to sit inside. I hope you enjoy the show and you enjoy the fest as a whole. Thank you very much.
gonna see this again. Me, I'm gonna buy it. I'm seeing sit down once.